Hello and welcome back to my Minecraft Survival Let's Play series. It's been a while since we've been in this world, but we're back. And uh, in today's episode, we are going to be doing, well, not something too big, but something that would be very nice to have. In the last episode, we built a bridge, which we're going to be taking a look at in a bit, because I have done some off-camera work, but I want to show you some stuff. Um, but basically, what we're going to be doing today is playing around with the smoker and the blast furnace, because currently we have this awesome furnace set up over here, which works wonders, I gotta say, I love it. But it would be nice to have something dedicated for food and for smelting ores, which the blast furnace and the smoker is for. So that is why we have this stuff in my inventory, because we are going to be making both blast furnaces and smokers. So we're going to be doing that today, but first let me just show you some stuff that I have been doing. So I have decorated a little bit with some plants and some parts. Yeah, not not big, not a big deal, but it's a little, it's a little bit. I got inspired by Atel when she did some stuff in my base, and I guess I'll show that in a moment or while I'm actually playing this. I might do that. Anyways, I got inspired to put these plants here and just some decorative stuff here because I, I didn't know what to put there. All right, guys. So we are in the creative world currently that Atel made the bridge for me in. And uh, the reason why we are in this world is because she made some design changes to that face is creepy to the base itself, which the thing that I just showed you in my single player world is taken from her. So the idea is her. But if we go down here, you can see that she is the one who made these um, potted, well, plants, bushes thing. She did put a couch here, but I didn't want the couch there. I wanted the other pattern instead because I don't want this area to be too too cramped. So I put the the decoration thing in the wall there instead. Yeah, yeah. Nah, I don't need a couch. I'm fine. <laughs> I did nor did I add the table here just because I, I, I might add it. Who knows? But uh, I'm just showing you what she did here. So going in and yeah. Faces everywhere. Um yeah, that's that's her vision of the place. E even the roof has a has a thing. Yeah, um, yeah. But I uh, I just I just want to show you this because she did use work do work on it, so I might as well show you. Um, I might add. I think I'll add more of these bushes just because they they do add some decorative stuff. It is birch leaves, so it fits with the theme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think you are. <laughs> <laughs> but she did do one thing here, um, which I thought was really clever. And instead of having blocks here, replace it all with barrels because it looks nice as a table. Plus you have storage underneath. So I'm definitely going to copy that idea. Probably going to do that off camera. Did she put anything behind these? Oh yeah. Cool. Kill. Cool. Um, and so then she put my water here. I'm going to copy a lot of these ideas. I just want to give her credit for it. Um, again, face and yeah, but I'll, I'll add some of these stuff just because I can. Uh, yeah, yeah. But anyways, that's just basically what I wanted to show you real quick, what she had done. Um, because I am getting most of these ideas from her. So just wanted to give her the proper credit. I should mention actually is that she did add some stuff like here. And then of course all the other faces around here. That one and, and that one. But I'm of course not going to add those. And uh, yeah. I'll I'll probably add these leaves in eventually. But uh, yeah, I, could, I could add a table or something. But I'll get to that eventually. <laughs> Alright. Enjoy the rest of the video. But let's go outside and there we have the amazing bridge. I didn't really do much to the bridge. In fact, I didn't do anything to the bridge in between episodes. I might have might have changed the stairs over there. I think I might have done that. I'm not sure. But I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah. I added in some stuff here. Made it look a little bit nicer. Kind of going in that direction. So that's cool. Then I don't remember if I did this in that episode. But I also added, I changed the fences out with some dark oak fences and placed these down below them. And I think it adds some more color and variety. So yeah, that I think is pretty cool. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I haven't, I haven't done anything else other than that. Uh, did I put, I don't remember if I did. Did I? Oh yeah, I, ow. Hold on. I added some random blocks in there because why not? Add some 
some randomness to it, I guess. But uh, I guess we should get up there and start working on the smokers and the the uh, blast furnace. And of course, because it's me, it's not just enough to place one and call it a day. We gotta get some hoppers involved. So let's get started. So I think we're gonna start with the smokers and I want them placed over here because this is my food chest. I have currently a lot of baked potatoes and carrots, not so much meat, but it's fine because I can live with carrots. Sorry, potatoes. Anyways, I thought of a system that I think would be pretty cool to have, where basically the smokers are put in here into the wall and then they output what they get into the chest here via hoppers and I think that would be pretty cool so let's make some stuff so I should technically have all I need to make all the hoppers that I need hopefully yep there we go okay so we need four hoppers in total and then we need some smokers cool I don't remember what I'm using these to oh yes of course actually I need more than that but uh, let's start here. So we are going to place some hovers, hold shift, and make them face the little nozzle there into the chest. Put the smoker up there. Put this back to make it look nicer. And uh, we could stop there. But I do think actually that I want some hovers inserting stuff into these guys. Because um, that would be pretty cool, I think. So we got to get all the way back here. There we go. So do that and that, and then place a chest up here, just in case we get a lot of food that we would like to smelt at once. You know what? That works. It's not the prettiest thing, but you know what? It works. Except for that. Gotta get that out of there. Okay. Cool. And then we can put some slabs up there or something. But you know what? It works. I would like to test it, though. Do I have... Yes, I do have a raw fish. Okay. The fish does not go into... Ah. Oh. L. They don't get items from back. From behind. Let's just see how this looks. It's not gonna look as great. I know that much. But, uh... Let's just see how this is going to look. If we actually put... The hoppers and such. Oh, <laughs> that's where my chests went. <laughs> okay, so we put those over there. We put that there. And that doesn't look as pretty as I would like it to. But, actually, you know what? That doesn't look too bad, actually. You know what? I kind of like that. Yep, I like it. <laughs> I like it a lot. So now if we put something here, it gets evenly, it gets, I like that it doesn't, that the chest actually, even though they're standing right next to each other, it gets, it still distributes it evenly. Because what I'm talking about is, if we, just, if we just take this back, hold on. So what I'm talking about here is when you have a double chest like this, it's two small chests placed next to each other. So one chest represents this part of the chest and another represents this area. So when I cut this off, for example, it cut off the bottom one. If I place it back, this still is the top one. If I remove this, I don't lose the content because this part of the chest is still here. If I place this here, this chest with the salmon that was before on top is now at the bottom. So I'm just happy that because the hopper is beneath this one, you would think that it would only take from this section if it wasn't made in a good way, but they've actually done it so that the hopper, even though it is on beneath this chest, it takes stuff from this side of the chest, which is pretty cool. I hope that made sense. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm glad that they, that they thought of that, and let's fix that, because that doesn't look nice. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what I wanted to do with that. Um, now, I did want to also do the same for the ores. Now, our resources are here, and I don't know if I want it into a separate chest here, which I then take from that over here, or if I should lead it from this from the blast furnaces to here. I don't know, because what I could do, I could move this in one, and then get some hoppers. It would take 
quite a few hoppers. It would take like, uh, if we place it here, for example, it would take one. Uh, it would take a few, <laughs> um, at least four or something. And that's 20 iron that I'm not kind of just willing to spend right now. So how about we just remove this? We place these back. And so I kind of want this moved back in a little bit. So let's, let's make the, the smokers first. Now I have to actually remember how on earth to do this. Ah, yes, we need the special type of stone. So I need, I don't remember what it's called, but I need a specific type of stone, which you get. Okay. That was a complete waste of coal, but you know what? It's fine. Um, but yeah, I need a specific type of stone. It's not this one. It is the smoother one. So I basically need, okay. Yeah, that, that, this was just plain stupid. <laughs> I need to smelt this again to make it, to get not the stone, but the smooth stone. So wait for it. That one, I need that. I need six of those. So I'm basically just gonna do that just to speed up the process. We started, we activated the coal, so you know what, we might as well use it for something. Otherwise it's just going to be a waste, which is going to be annoying. All right, there we go. Okay. That should be everything. And there we go. Perfect. Now we can make it. So you put three down here, normal furnaces in the middle, surrounded with iron and boom, blast furnaces. Okay. Awesome. So I'm just going to put them here. Then I need some hoppers. I used all, I calculated it wrong because I added that extra part up there. Um, yeah, hold, hold on a moment. Okay. This should do who is outside spider. Get out of here, boy. Interrupting. Stop the interruptions. There we go. Okay. So place the chest point. Get rid of that first. Place those there, do that. And now this is the part where I could actually very simply just not fall. Redirect one down, actually. Uh, yeah, I could lead it one over and then into one. It would only take two hoppers more actually. And you know what? I might do it just because I can and it would look cool. You know what? Let's just do it. Let's just, unless do these things melt stone. They do. Hmm. Oh, maybe they don't. Hold on. If I can shift click something in there, it doesn't. I can, and I can shift click stone in there. Okay, good. You know what? Then we're going to do that because that is less work for me when I have to not move things down so or over rather so i'm gonna put that there i'm gonna put that on top of that and then that and that so whatever goes in here goes to this one which 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 goes in here so that's pretty cool i could actually lower it one yeah let's lower it one then we can't see the hoppers and it's going to look a little bit nicer and it's going to spare us a hopper. So let's do that. Give me back my stuff and do that. Put these on top and then I'm going to need, no, I'm going to need one more. Give me that. Give me, I'm going to need one more hopper here. So let's just make that. I have plenty of iron, so this shouldn't be an issue whatsoever. Okay. Put that there. Chest, chest. Where? Where's my chest? Oh, well. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much that actually. Um, do I want that there? I don't think I do. Let's, let's move this back one. Let us, uh, let's remove this corner place here. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's the wrong one. Let me see. You know, this could actually kind of look nice. 
I don't know. I'm going to replace this with birch wood because otherwise I'm going to go crazy. And I know other people will go crazy when watching this. So, uh, yeah, let me just let me just find some birch wood. Hold on. You know what my worst nightmare is going to be? If a creeper blows up on this bridge. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, give me this stuff. I'll put it back once I'm done with it. Cool. So slap, 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 and full block. Awesome. I like that. I like that. I don't like this, but you know what? I'll just have to live with it until I actually do the walls. I'm, I need inspiration for the walls, but uh, I'll figure something out. Okay, so now that should be that. I'm going to put this amount of coal in these guys. If I put gold in here, it even splits it between them. Skeleton. But look at that speed though. Oh, hold on. They should get... Oh, yeah, that's an issue. I thought it would get into the right portion of the chest. But it's not. Okay, so I just did some testing in creative and unfortunately you cannot do this. It does not automatically jump into place, which I wish it did, but it doesn't. So we are going to have to go with the old way. With the old way that we originally wanted to do things. So yeah, that's a bit annoying, but you know what? That's just how that goes sometimes. So let me just get this back and get it back to how it should. Uh, don't break that. Don't break that. Because we, we don't need that broken. <laughs> we don't need this broken. Let's just put that back there. Okay. And uh, you know what? Yeah. Yeah, that's going to drive people crazy. Let's just put that. Okay. Oh well, we learn from our mistakes, right? Gonna have a chest here, up there, up there, get X away, blast furnace, we're gonna have hover, hover. Hold on. Chest there. Okay. The other thing would have been cooler, but you know what? It's fine. That's just how things go. At least they're right next to each other. Hey Skelly. Goodbye. But yeah, at least they're right next to each other. And I'm gonna break this because I keep moving this back <laughs> each time I'm doing something. So I should probably get rid of it completely. Also, yeah, it might have some lighting issues, but we, we won't talk about it. How's the light level? Seven. Great. I don't want. Okay. Anyways, that is pretty much that done. So let me just give them back that coal. And that's going to make it a lot easier for us when we come back home from a mining expedition. Just throw everything in. Just throw everything in there. And um, yeah, it's going to be done way quicker. Or if we just need something quick, it's going to be done. But I will still be using this if I have large quantities of something specific. Let me just clear my inventory because I think... We might have time to do one last thing. Because you see, I thought of doing something. Oh, could even do it here. Eh. Um, I thought of doing something. Which was, because I'm constantly going up here, the stair is nice. But it would be nicer to have a water elevator. Now, I don't know if we should do it in this episode or the next one. I think we might need to do it in the next one, because I think I need to do a bit more planning. I need some soul, soul sand and such. Yeah, I think we got to do that next time, and I think we might actually place it right here. Let's see, where is that going to put us? If we stand right here, so that's minus 226 and minus 36. Okay, let's see where that is. If we go up here, so minus 26. Uh, so that's ow, right on top of the campfire, of course. No, wait, it's over here. So that would put us right there. So we could actually make a little elevator hut right here with some doors. Actually, right next to the path. 
Okay, you know what? <laughs> I'm excited about this. We're gonna do that in the next episode. I had originally thought of installing an elevator over here, but you know what? We're gonna install an elevator right here for easy access to the farm. All right, that's gonna be cool. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave it a like, subscribe if you haven't yet, and enable those notifications. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you next time where we're gonna be making a water elevator. Hopefully I'm gonna get everything before then, like soul sand and such, but uh, yeah. I'll make sure to do that. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.